Hi guys, so this is the first episode of my PLL series suggested by Brian. Sorry this video is kind of late, but yeah, I just didn't really have much time to record. So how this is going to work is every weekend, um, once a weekend and probably on Tuesday or Wednesday I'll upload one video of one um, one PLL so I'm gonna start from the easy PLLs and get harder so obviously in my opinion the easiest one is an H perm so there will be um, the annotations the algorithm at the bottom for you to follow along but the algorithm for this is M2 U prime, or if you're uh, if you do your M slices with your um, left hand, then you would do just a U. So, but I do mine with my right hand, so it's M two U prime, M two U two, and M two U prime M two. So that's really easy, and you can get it really fast. Um, so how I finger trick it is basically. Um, I, since it's an M2, I need two fingers to do my M slice with, so I use um, this finger and this finger. So I have it at the back, so if green's facing me, then I'd have these fingers at the back, so then I first uh, flick it with my uh, ring finger and then with my middle finger. And if you can see this, that's how I do my M slices. Um, so yeah that's the M slices. Now for the uh, U slices I just for the single ones I just do it with my left pointer finger. Whoops, let's do that again. So M2 U like that. And then um, for the U2 my cat is just still on my lap so so she might she might come into the in frame. So M two U and then M two and then U two like this. Hey Steph. Hey. Um and then again this M two and then just a single U and then M two again. U two. U two again is with pointer and middle finger. So to recognize this algorithm, um, I'd say it's pretty easy to recognize, I mean, it's really easy to recognize, but for those of you who are as bright as a broken light, um, I'll tell you how to recognize it anyway. So by now I'd say that you're pretty comfortable with the color scheme of the cube. If you're not, then you probably wouldn't be learning PLL at the moment. So. As you know, green is opposite of blue, red is opposite of orange, and white is opposite of yellow. So, from any angle of this, I can see if there's an opposite color um, surrounded by two, two, it, sorry, if there's one color surrounded by two of the opposite colors, then I know it's an H perm. Um, but it could also be a different algorithm. So I just give a quick glance to one of the other sides, and if it's the same, um, one color surrounded by two of the opposite colors, then I know it's an H perm, and then I can do my algorithm. So, yeah, that's the H perm, and I hope this helped. Tell me what you think of the series so far, and, well, so far I've only taught you the H perm, but tell me if you think you would like this, and if it helps you. So yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!